Hey there, it's Stephanie Shea, Chief Astrologer for JanSpiller.com, and I just wanted to let you know about your 2021 sun sign prediction reports. I've mentioned them on a few of the horoscope videos in the past. This is just a special announcement video to let you know they're up on the JanSpiller.com website. I'll put the link in the comments below this video and they are specific reports for each sun sign. Some of the information does apply to rising signs too. So you could look at both of those. And what I do is track the outer planet activity for the entire year. I look at the aspects these outer planets would make to your sun sign. I look what houses it might go through for different rising signs and look for some overall themes and lessons that you can tune into for the year ahead. There's some key dates in there about when certain planets might be retrograde, and it's a very useful tool for the year if you like to kind of get a heads up on what's going on with your personal astrology. I always try to come at it from a very practical standpoint, from a very empowering standpoint, so you don't feel you're at the mercy of astrology. This was never something that Jan Spiller uh, ascribed to. We are all about empowering astrology here at the janspiller.com website. And that was a main message that she instilled in her work. It's being carried forward in my work. She trained me to do these reports. So I've been doing them almost a decade now. And I really wanted to just point people in that direction. They're $9.95, but it's all money that goes to help support Jan's legacy. Uh, it was her wish to keep the website going as a resource to help people. We do everything we can to make things low cost so you can have access to this information that can be really useful in your life. And so that's all I have for you on this message. Just wanted to point you in that direction. I encourage you to check it out. There's a lot of interesting outer planet activity going on for 2021 with two of the outer planets that just moved into Aquarius, of course, Saturn and Jupiter. That's setting a whole new tone for the year. We've got Uranus moving forward in the sign of Horus starting to shake things up in new ways. It's all stuff you can look at in your personal life and it can help guide decisions and your outlook on life and the most successful approaches to different types of problem solving and interpersonal relationship skills. So I hope you will check that out and thanks so much for watching and I hope you've been enjoying these horoscopes and I'm going to keep them coming for you and happy 2021.